it is to me, anyway. But the, uh, the Blood Elves and the, uh, the Forsaken, like, they, um, they have a connection, and, uh, it's not really readily apparent unless you, I mean, of course, I know what's going on, and you probably, you guys probably do, too, because you know, you know, I've, I've kind of covered some of the stuff that's going on. Hopefully, we'll, uh, there's a quest item that I'm going to get uh, that's going to help uh, kind of stick all of that together, and uh, and I'll kind of get more into that when we get to that point. Uh, I mean, I, I don't think I'm really going to be spoiling anything. I, I, th I would think anybody watching this probably knows as much about WoW as I do, but... <laughs> Which, in hindsight, after watching uh, some lore videos, um, I actually don't know that much. <laughs> well, did you bring me what I need? Hurry, or the pretty blood elf boy is a goner. Just in time, Valene. I was about ready to start digging a hole for our friend here. My, so po my potion seems to be working. He's coming to. Hey, I think he's trying to get your attention. Why don't you talk to him? So we're starting to get Tranquillian reputation. Uh, I, I'm too weak to continue. I carry a dire warning from Regent Lord Theron <laughs> in the form of a letter. You'll have to deliver it for me. Take it to Arcanus Vandral in Tranquillian. You'll find a town further to the south along this road. So we're going to get another bag, which we are in dire need of, and uh, a bracer that we will actually give us a bit of an upgrade. It seemed, in my memory, it seemed like that, um, she had a bit more of a, um, speech that she gave, but I guess not, um, you know, nostalgia. Uh, but yeah, the, uh, the Blood Elves and the Forsaken, they, they kind of, they get along pretty well. Uh, they share a lot of the same goals. Uh, they're very much outsiders, even from the Horde, you know, like the Horde... You know, you, you've got the uh, the orcs and the trolls and the torrent, and they all kind of bonded together um, and during the third glory to the Sindori. Warlock, you didn't happen to see a courier on your way here. We are uh, waiting word from Silvermoon City. Yeah, you have a letter. Uh, yes. Finally, we waited for a response from the Regent Lord for weeks. Let me s see here. What's this? A dark presence. He senses a dark presence in the ghost land? No kidding. I could have told him that. Is this is what we've been waiting for? Remember the sun well. Arcanus Vandral, what are the Forsaken doing here? The situation is more grim than many have been led to believe. The Forsaken are here as allies to fight against our common enemy, the Scourge. Trust me when I say this. Without them, the Ghostlands would have been lost, would be lost, and the Scourge would already have overrun all of Eversong Woods. But more than anything else, we need your help in reclaiming our once proud lands. Keep your wits about you. Our enemies will fall. I know it seems strange, but these Forsaken are here to help. You should speak with their leader, High Executor Maverin. He's in the tower to the west of town. And Warlock, when you're done talking with him, return to me. I have something dire that needs to be dealt with immediately. Alright. So you don't get a bunch of quests right off the bat here. Because um, we're still... Um, I think we're neutral with them. No time. Uh, yeah, we're still actually neutral with Tranquility. Uh, so this was, um, I think, Blizzard's really first attempt at, uh, um, like, having rep, rep rewards at, like, low levels. Uh, like, right now, you can go into any major city and get, 
uh, rep stuff for all of your factions. Uh, but that really wasn't in um, when Burning Crusade came out. There was a few factional rewards, but they were like really high level. Uh, so this, uh, but Blizzard kind of added this in. So. Wow. The dark times will pass. Welcome to Tranquillion, Warlock. I apologize for the state that you find it in. As you can see, we've been having some trouble, but the Forsaken and their Lady Sylvanas Windrunner have been gracious enough to lend us a great deal of assistance in our time of need. If you could lend a hand, please do not hesitate to do so. We can use all of the help that we can get in our struggle against the myriad forces arrayed against us. Remember the sun well. What is it? I know that we Forsaken appear monstrous to your eyes, but I assure you, we mean your people no harm. We're here because of the common enemy, Darkon the Traitor. He has returned and now commands the Scourge that are invading this land from his steadfast death home to the south. Our, later, our lady, our leader, Lady Sylvanas Windrunner, originally hails from these lands. In fact, used to be an elf. She has a history with Darkon and wants him dead as much as your people do. We will defeat him together. Now, my friend, it would be if you would be so kind as to return to Arcanist Vandral, I know that he is very anxious to send you out on your first mission here in the Ghostlands. We're counting on you, Valene. Don't let us down. And you, uh... Deathstalker Maltendus. The corpses of trolls buried inside the Amani catacombs have been rising from the dead. I want you to go there and bring back proof of their final demise. Some of these mummy trolls and their living carry counterparts carry juju, glowing objects that house an unknown power source. It's probably what is animating them. The catacombs lie within Sungray's Peak, directly to the east. I'm told that the easiest way in lies on the north face of the mountain. Yeah, alright. Let's see what... I like those gloves. Those white Draw fingerless ones. State your business. Warlock. Our sources tell us that the trolls buried in the Amani catacombs inside Sun Grace Peak have been rising from the dead. Dame a Furious? Yeah. Would have you investigate these catacombs and put to the torch any of the an unanimated remains you come across so as to prevent any more of these creatures from rising. The fastest way there is to head north out of town and then take the first fork to the right. This will put you on the north side of the peak, so look to the south for the entrance. The first time I did that quest, it confused. Those directions just confused the crap out of me. <laughs> Ooh, and there's a wanted poster over here. Oh, oh we've got picked up several quests. Yeah, when WoW first came on, there was like no, none of this. Like you. Tracking them on the mini-map, that wasn't going on. So. To find a cure for the plague, we need to understand how it affects different creatures. From the most complex life forms to the lowliest subspecies. I've come here to study the murlocs, since, like us, they've restrained... They've retained free will, will in undeath. What makes these lowly mongrels so special? I need to find out. Travel northwest and bring me their their spine so that I may study the accumulation of plague in the marrow. Alright. Well. Uh, and here is... Oh wait, that's poison supplies. Um, there's a, uh, a rep vendor around here somewhere. I'll show you. If we can even interact with them. Uh, a bounty is hereby declared for the abominations known as Nokorot and L Luzran. These dreadful creatures of Darkon are extremely dangerous and have been sighted patrolling near the howling and bleeding ziggurats. Individuals seeking to claim the reward must present the abominations heads to Deathstalker Rathiel, Rathiel as proof of the deed. So yeah, we're definitely going to be grabbing those pretty quick. Warlock trainer, don't really need. Innkeeper, uh, yes, innkeeper. Let us stay the course. 
sense. This will make sense later. Uh, cooking trainer. Smithing. Uh, Magistrates of Eminem. Trade supplies. Maybe they, uh, maybe they removed that. Rep vendor. Well, that would be disappointing. Uh, general goods. Be quick about your business. Uh, Goodbye. Well, actually, I do need I to empty out some bag space. Yes, I'm totally obsessing over what she looks like. Next I'm sorry. <laughs> what is it? Uh, tumor supplies. How am I supposed to supply the war effort when I cannot even safely get my supplies here? I was promised an escort that never came, and then I had to leave one of my carts behind to the west when I was attacked by a band of ghouls. Want to help out and get me open for business in the process? Go down the western road out of town and past the graveyard. On the other side of the dead scar is a fork in the road. The hill that my cart has been left on lies just beyond. Yay, we're over our withdrawals. Oh good, there you are. And just in time, there is much to be done. We're surrounded here, Warlock. The outlying villages have all been overrun by the scourge. We must head northeast to Suncrown Village immediately and deal with the Nerubian Scourge Menace. You can't miss them. They're spider-like creatures. There's no time to waste. Quell the Lost must be reclaimed. The Reckoning is at hand. All right. So we've got a lot of stuff scattered out here. Um, let's see. Let's go... We'll make like a little loop and then... Yeah, the, um, uh, this guy that's an expert, or, uh, wanting to study the, um, uh, the effects of the plague, this kind of sets you up for, uh, something that happens in, um, see, there's the entrance to the, uh, um, tombs, so we'll get back to that in just a little bit. Um, like when you get to uh, Wrath of the Lich King on the Horde side, there's a very long uh, mission that you'll go into. Um, stung. That's cute. Uh, come closer. I'm dying. I was sent here to slay these Nerubians, but Vandril didn't know that they have a leader. Uh, he, mu he must find and slay Anak Sutin. Get help. She wanders around. I'm not gonna need help. See, right there it is. Oh, it is an actual elite. Not that. Yeah. Yeah, the, uh, those heirlooms make all of this stuff like just. We gotta kill ten of these. That that actually might take a while because they're kind of scattered. I mean, it's not. It doesn't take long to kill each one, but just running around finding them. So I um, 
Yeah, I haven't done that much, but I think I'm going to go on and do that since there's not a lot of them up here. I'll just to uh, do a quick pause and I'll, I'll be back in just a minute. Oops, uh, I leveled up. Sorry. <laughs> um, so I got to level 15 and uh, of course unlocked uh, Wailing Caverns, Rage, Fire, Chasm, and the Dead Mines. Which I'm probably not even going to do, to be honest. Um, let's see. Let's see. Restores 20% of maximum health over 12 seconds to you and your pet. Increases all healing received. Drain soul and haunt. Grant you and your pet shadow shields. That's actually kind of handy. I don't have drain soul, though, yet. Uh, drain life deals 50% more damage and 100% more healing. So that's 162. So that would be uh, about 200, 50% increase. And I'll probably use that a lot. Um, a clickable heal, though, that's kind of handy. Let's go on and use that because um, that actually will increase I think healing even from our health stones uh, I'm not I'm not a hundred percent sure about that <clears throat> so yeah I'm probably not going to do um, any dungeons really at all Because uh, heirlooms just, I mean, they make questing go really, really fast. Um, and um, you don't really have to uh, worry about gear that much. I mean, I know that there's some in dungeons that are, um, you know, uh, some, some gear like gloves and belts and... Wow, these guys are actually not level. Excellent. Yeah. Yeah, I've got a, uh, actually, um, my, uh, uh, G600 gaming mouse came in yesterday. <clears throat> and my cat is like flipping out because the uh, it smells different. Like it's got a uh, not like a really strong plasticky smell, um, but it, it's it's noticeable. And I guess like she she doesn't like it. Uh, and it's got like this braided uh, mouse cord instead of like just uh, the plastic the plastic one. It's uh, like a braided cloth, uh, which is really cool. Um, and um, it's still recharging. Oh, he resisted it. <laughs> so like that, uh, that's kind of freaking her out. These, uh, this is um, also a um, a rogue training area. These burial chests. Um, you can uh, once you get uh, pick lock. Uh, you can come up here and practice your, wow, your big lock skill. Which, uh, actually, I don't even, rem I don't know if that's still a thing or not. Um, like, you have to uh, practice your uh, pick lock to keep it leveled up. Uh, I know that was kind of a thing uh, back in vanilla, is uh, you would go to certain areas and uh, they would have... Um, Getting soul shards again? Is that a thing? Um, soul shards used to be um, you had to have uh, like they were a 
you had to have a bag for them. Um, like they took up bag space 